Audio is on. Audio is on. Video is turning on. Video is turning on. The recording is open. Five, three, two, 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 one, and go. Now we're going to click on file because it is cool. So here we go. File. I missed. File. Now we're going to click away from file. Oh, we're going to click away from file because it's not really that cool. So here we go. What is up, guys? I'm JKU390. And my name is Shark Steve. And we're back in Dragon Ball Z The Legacy of Goku 2, where we forgot to grind like we said we were going to. So, sorry. <laughs> so, yes, more video of us beating up alligators, apparently. Because uh, yeah. these are these are wonderful. Because creatures. of how much uh, experience we're getting, we're obviously way too underleveled. Mm hmm. Also, the fact of how much they hurt me. Thanks. Yeah, seriously. Uh, yeah. Yay, attacking from a distance. I like the bully alligators. There we go. I find I find it really funny how there's I know with sprites you have limited options, but it they're What's so this? tiny. Oh, it's just a more powerful punch. They're just really, really tiny alligators. Now see, I thought they were colossal alligators. Really? Well, in compare like height wise. Well, height wise, yeah, but length wise, alligators and crocodiles. Yeah, they're they're small. They length. should be a lot longer. But could you imagine if there's just like a giant, just all it looked like a snake? Well, no, you just got to make the tail a little longer. See how it barely juts out behind their legs? It makes them cute. Sure, <laughs> we'll call them cute. They're adorable. Ugh. Do you not like them? No, they're not that cute. They're adorable. Look at him. He's like, wow. Yeah. I'm a alligator. I'm a. <laughs> It's <sighs> okay. It's all about the eye of the beholder. If you say so. And I behold them as beautiful. Good for you. You know what I behold as beautiful? Me. Swan princesses. Me. Swan princesses. And I actually thought you were going to say food. <laughs> 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 but... I would. I would say food. I love food. I love well, food like more than life. What's like your go-to thing do? you like it more than me? Um, I don't know. Like, my greatest compliment to somebody would probably be like, I love you almost or more than this food. But you told me the other <laughs> day that you like I don't me always than, say that. You texted that. me the other day you like me more than food. Yeah. So you don't need more? What happened? Wait, what food was I eating yesterday? No, it was just food in general. Oh. Well, I, okay, I guess I do then. Well, <laughs> that's how it works. It's not you think you do. You, you need to know. I don't know. I mean, like, food is... Food is love. Food is life. I mean... So you love food more than you love me? Maybe. Sometimes. Sometimes? Sometimes. What the yeah. <laughs> so you pick food over me? No. I mean, I do kind of need food to live. Yeah, but you need me to live. <laughs> sure. Um, I guess I love you more than most foods. <laughs> <laughs> nah, just kidding. I do love you <laughs> more Just kidding. Than you don't foods. love me more than any food. I don't love you more than all this kind of food. Except these kind of foods. Except Brussels sprouts. <laughs> Actually, I like Brussels sprouts. I was joking. <laughs> but you don't like pickles. I don't like pickles, except on hamburgers. Hmm. And, um, like, other stuff like that. Like, there's a <laughs> section of food in my, like, food diary where... <laughs> I know, food diary, but... There's a section of food Dear in... diary. In my list of Brussels foods. Brussels sprouts. Where... I don't like them by themselves, but I like them with stuff. Like mushrooms. I love them in egg rolls and in spaghetti and on like certain kinds of, of sandwiches. You know how they have like the portobello mushroom burger or whatever the, what are they called? And um, I like mushrooms with stuff, but I do not like mushrooms by themselves. Like if there's just like slice, like chunks of mushroom in a dish, then I'm like, eh, the texture by itself is just gross to me. Well, as you know, I have an osmia. I can't smell or taste, but that aside, I still am not a fan of like a lot of fruits or vegetables or anything like that. I don't like the textures of them, and I'm explaining this for the viewers. Yeah, as well. I know. <clears throat> well, I did learn recently that the only time that I like either of these foods, which is burgers mm -hmm. or vegetables, yeah. is combined. Really? And what do you mean by it, that? Well, and fruit, I guess, has to be there too. But well, because I actually enjoyed a burger that had lettuce, tomato. Is that my make sure fruits uh -huh. in there too? Um, pickles and something else on it. And other than that, I won't just eat vegetables. Yeah. So I was like, aha, I found my way to actually get vegetables. I just have to eat a, an You just have burger. to eat it as a burger yeah. form. I guess it's because, um, because instead of just tasting each texture by itself, exactly. you get to taste all it together. And I know I watch the Food Channel a lot, so 
I like that's one of the things that whoa giant fish. We got one that's one times. of the things that um that the food critics always talk about is how like textures have to blend together in dishes, but yes. not like like they complain so much whenever a single dish has like too much of one texture in it. And sometimes for me, like, I kind of like just eating large servings of one things at a time. Like, I buy cans of corn and other vegetables by themselves just so I can eat them, like, all as one thing in its own grapes. serving. But, um, well, see, even grapes have two textures, the skin on the outside of the grapes mm -hmm. and the That's squishy like grapeness in the inside. Purple grapes. So, um, like, food is weird. I love food. And I can talk about food and I can eat food and <laughs> I love food. <laughs> Although looking at you, you can't tell. Really? Oh, thanks. Yeah, I I was blessed to not become obese. <laughs> I, like me, I'm so fat. Yeah, you're so fat. Look at that too. Oh, he's such a cute dummy. I'm rubbing my sweet abs. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I just knocked into the microphone because I was too excited about your sweet abs. <laughs> you just wanted an excuse to rub my stomach. <laughs> nah. Yeah, you don't need an excuse. <laughs> um. No, nah, but I love... No, I have to thank my mom for that, because... For food? Yeah, as much as I hated my mom's regulations on me growing up... Um, like uh, me. <laughs> like you. Um, I was one of her biggest regulations. <laughs> seriously. Um, my mom always, like, really watched my eating. Like, she was one of those, like, food Nazis, I guess you could say, where she only fed me, like, certain kind of stuff, and she always regulated how much I eat at every meal and stuff <clears> like that, you know? Yep. So I guess that's one of the reasons why I'm not obese and how nowadays I've still been able to keep, almost, keep up with myself with how much I eat. I mean, for the past, like, few years I've been eating a lot more, and now I'm trying to cut back again. For the past year, I think you've been eating more. Really, the past year? Yeah. Not not two years? Because I've thought it's been like the past two years, actually. Mm. There's my third fish, by the way. I can get a sense of bean. Ooh, very nice. Wait, I think we got like a little fish. So do you think those count? Or do you think like the I big just fish count fish. for more? Oh, okay. <laughs> Destroy all the alligators. Or crocodiles. I yeah, still I haven't decided yet. <laughs> well, which one's the one? The crocodiles are the ones that you see their teeth, right? On the sides? Um, I really never or remember. Is that alligator? I forget every time. I mean, I could Google that right now if we wanted to. Nah. Like, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Have you ever tried alligator meat? Because they sell that at, like, uh, uh, here where we say, live. They have names. a, um, they have, like, this huge fair here where we live. And, um, they sell a lot of, like, different foods. Like, one year they were selling deep-fried um, turkey testicles. testicles. Yeah, and bull testicles. And they used to sell alligator meat and, like, chocolate-dipped uh, crickets and weird stuff like that. Just, like, you know, crazy food that you only ever get at, like, this really crazy at fair. At a festival, <laughs> yeah. And, um... A testicle festival. I never... I really wanted to try the turkey testicles whenever they were, um... Whenever they uh, had them that one year, but they ran out by the time I got over Why to the booth. Why did you want to try them? I just was really curious as to what they would taste like because I remember, as I said, I've watched the Food Channel and like they, and the Travel Channel. The Travel Channel has a few food-related stuff too. No, they talk about. Um, they don't talk about it all the time, obviously. But I whenever it, it actually case. happened, I rem I think it was on the on the uh, Discovery Channel or the Travel Channel. There's this one, I think his name is like Andrew Zimmerman. I really loved his show. Like he'd go around the country and like, and around the um, planet and like try different foods. And it was really fun. And I remember like there was one or two episodes about bull testicles and they're always, they have like apparently a very interesting texture to them. Like they're not actually like gross, like how you would think whenever they're cooked. I don't know. I'd rather not think about it to be honest. Anyways, the reason why I started talking about that is because the alligator meat. Last year, I tried some at our fair, and it was okay. Like, it wasn't that great. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I thought I would like it a lot, but it was like, they were like these small chunks I know Lucas likes bits. alligator. He does? Yeah. Oh, good for him. Again, it's because he's Cajun. They're Cajun delicacies. <laughs> Bunch of freaking daters in the bayou. I love shrimp. When they go I mean, to Louisiana. there's a lot of shrimp stuff and crawfish. Oh my god, I love crawfish. Ugh. How do you call them crawfish? Hmm? Do you call them crawfish? Yeah. I call them crawdads. Crawdads? Mm -hmm. I call them crawfish. I think I picked up crawdad from my dad. Mm -hmm. That's what he calls them. Does he? Mm -hmm. 
That's cool. I've like I guess nobody in my family has ever called them crawdads because I've always just known them as crawfish. I don't remember when I first heard the term. Oh, it's crawdad. kind of like one of those things like uh, fireflies and lightning bugs. Yeah, I call them by both, but I think I think I called them more lightning bugs than fireflies. As a kid, I called them lightning bugs a lot more, mm. and I think more recently, I still call them lightning bugs a lot when I'm talking to people around here. But mm -hmm. I call them fireflies a lot because that's more of a universal term I think for them. Um, oh, what was I thinking Should we about? just continue forward? No, not yet. Oh, so this entire part's literally going to be grinding while we talk about food and I stuff. I mean, I don't see the problem with it. I mean... As long as the viewers enjoy... We can tell uh, the viewers that they can, like, skip this episode That's if they true. wanted to. <laughs> they can skip any of them if they want. Yeah, well, seriously, yeah, none of them are really important. <laughs> What was- oh, you just interrupted my thought where I was going to talk crawfish. about- No, before- after that, we were talking about fireflies, and then- oh! Um, a million of them. There's a- there are, um, quizzes and stuff on the internet where you can take that, um, talk about the different dialogues that you have. Like, you know how, uh, different places around America all say different things for different- Yeah. Whatevers. Kevin and I, uh, Black Sora, who lives mm -hmm. in California- We've had actual multiple readings of stuff like that. We talked about what we call different things. Really? And they have a bunch of uh, statistics on what calls, like, different things what. Mm -hmm. It's weird some of the things that we actually have different names for. Really? Mm -hmm. And I can't remember any of them. Like, the most, the one that people always go to first is soda, pop, coke, etc. That's like, you hear a lot Just of. carbonated drinks. What do you call it? Um, I call it, uh, soda. Yeah, I call it soda. Yeah. And, um... My mom calls it a coke. Your mom calls it Coke? Yeah, if she talks about any soda in general, she just says a Coke. Hmm. See, I haven't ever met anybody here where we live <laughs> call it pop before. No. Mm -mm. Pop seems more like an older term to me. Yeah. Which isn't saying much, because I'm still like one of the only people alive that still says supper. Supper? Yeah. Uh, I use the term supper occasionally. I just It just depends on what time I decide to have I my dinner. I always say supper or din din. Yeah, I say din din all the time. <laughs> um, what was I going to say? About, oh yeah, according to like a, one of the quizzes that I took about the uh, dialects of America, apparently I belong in Michigan, I think, is where it said that my well, dialogue best fits in. That's only north of us. I know, it's only uh, not that far away from us. But, it's a state north. <laughs> but um, still, it was interesting to know, think that I sound like my dialect is apparently more northern, but whenever I talk to people... They say that I have a southern accent. Well, you and I have talked about this before. Yeah. Where whenever you go back to where your family lives, you definitely pick up more of a southern drawl. Mm-hmm. Like, it's it's terrible whenever I go visit my relatives. That's what I'm saying. You, you become <laughs> a lot more southern sounding. Like, I do. It's so terrible because they call where we live, like, Amish country. And it's like, <laughs> are you freaking serious? I know I've told you this Indiana before. Indiana is Amish country. I'm just showing it. Sharing it with you. Yeah, it's so stupid because, like, yeah, we have corn everywhere. That is a true we stereotype. We don't really have that much corn around here. <laughs> I love corn. But there's, we have all the corn. We don't have that much corn. I mean, if well, we go uh, here, further. Well, here, where we live, yeah, there's no corn. But if you, like, go out to the outside, outer skirts of the city, there's a bunch of farmland everywhere. Well, yeah, that's if you go to the country. Yeah, exactly. That's why I said that it was, like, most of I hope Indiana we go to Florida, is Florida, there's an ocean. Oh. <laughs> like... It's funny because I say stuff, I more than usually say stuff like y'all and yonder, and then they point it out, and I'm like, I'm sorry. What type of accent do I have? I don't know what kind of accent you have. You have a very English accent to me, in my opinion. Oh boy, I'm from England. No, no not that kind of English. Well, sorry. JK, I don't want to be from England. <laughs> um, let me see. Um, oh. What is it? Oh, the screen Oh, it just took a time to load. <laughs> <clears throat> nah, Matt's from England. He's cool. I think Dean was technically born in England, but I still count him as my Welsh friend. Really? Yep. You've been to the British Isles? Yeah, I have. Have you been to all four? Yep. All right. And te technically five if you count, um... Nope. Well, no. <laughs> no, I meant, like, it, I've been to all five sections of that area where you know how Northern Ireland is yeah, different I know from the Republic of Ireland. Well, because, yeah, part of it's not actually part of the UK. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's the Republic, right? Mm. The Republic is not part of the UK. And, um, oh my gosh, I had so much fun. Like, you know how they always say grass is greener on the other side? The uh, grass is legitimately greener there. It's so pretty. Yeah, it seems like they do that <laughs> way in a lot, because whenever you see pictures, of, especially Scotland. Mm-hmm. And... Oh my gosh, I thought that, I, I know I've told you this already, but I thought that I would love Ireland more. I loved Scotland more. Scotland was 
beautiful. Oh my gosh. And it's the same way with stuff with like New Zealand, which is perfect because uh, like the Shire and stuff in Lord of the Rings, mm -hmm. it looks so much cooler the way the grass is there. Oh, beautiful. In New Zealand. <laughs> I just love European countries because I just, th as much as America has so many beautiful places European. in it, what? New Zealand's not European. Oh, New Zealand is by is by, by Australia. Australia. Dang it! Why did I say that? I was thinking of what is that country that I was thinking of? You know how there's those three really long countries very north of Europe. Ah, uh, I can't remember. Like, like, the Arctic. N uh, n no, it's south of the Arctic, but I can't remember. Greenland what and Iceland, and no, uh, that's a bit more north of us. Some one of the viewers will understand what I'm talking about, but I thought you were talking about over there, and I <laughs> I feel so stupid for forgetting. And um, what was I thinking? Oh, oh well. About New Zealand. <laughs> this is just a filler episode, so it doesn't really you're, matter what I'm thinking. You're thinking of the Zealands and the Aussies, the Osbournes, and Aussie Osbournes. Yeah, <laughs> that's cute. That's where the Australians live in Aussie Osborne. Oh. He ate them. Oh. Like a bat. Oh. I'm just, I'm really surprised we're not getting more fish. It makes me sad. Like, well, alligators I, aren't makes known me to swallow fish whole. It so makes it's me not think that, like, maybe we're supposed to, like, hit these alligators in, like, a specific way. I don't know. And, like, maybe with some kind of combo attack, it'll like bring us. Like Super some... Saiyan! <laughs> don't bite my dick. Ah, <laughs> 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 don't bite my dick. <laughs> he did it. <laughs> Very nice. Hey, at least you're still alive and not bleeding from the garage. Oh man, that'd make this game so much darker. Oh, I was watching, um, what was it, Monsters Inside Me, which is a TV show about, um, like, Enties. viruses and, oh. you know, those kind of tapeworms and stuff that get yeah. inside you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, um, it got me on to the idea of thinking of, you know how there's that one fish in, like, the Amazon or something? That'll that... swim up your pee stream yep. and go into your dick? <laughs> Never heard of it. Oh, so gross. That'd be terrible. Yeah. Have it lay its babies in there. Put some eggs in your... In my, well, not your, but in, in my ball sack. <laughs> so, hypothetic. Why am I so much slower as Super Saiyan Vegeta? I don't... Uh, oh. Uh, that was uh, really weird. I never noticed that. Uh, but what were uh, you thinking, oh, hypothetically? Uh, okay, so, I get the fishies in my, in my wiener. Uh-huh. And then they lay eggs. Uh huh. Then I reproduce. Uh huh. Would the eggs go into the person that I reproduce with? What? Oh, I don't know if it would work that way. <laughs> See, I don't know more of the science behind the whole laying of eggs. And I'm in... not much on the whole uh, reproductive anatomy. <laughs> Why is Vegeta so slow? Uh. This is so. Uh. <laughs> 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 Oh. He does the same thing. My hair's thing. so heavy. <laughs> it grew an extra foot. <laughs> it's actually taller than me now. <laughs> I see how poor Raditz felt. Oh, Raditz. If he went Super Saiyan 3, he'd just be a tire. <laughs> oh. A tire. <laughs> like, his hair is. It just would like... fold around underneath him, go up behind <laughs> him, and he'd choke to death on it. Wow. Oh. Oh. God, he is really slow. It's <laughs> god-awful. Like, don't we have capsules and stuff to help, like, level up our characters? Yeah, according Didn't to Didn't I mention this last time? <laughs> About how we needed to give some to Piccolo or something. God, I can't believe we've almost been recording for 20 minutes. <laughs> hey, we're talking. We're having fun. BTW, um, we just had a uh, very nice time reading a comic together. Yeah, well, we, we should talk about the comics. We just got some free comics. Yeah, and um, they're awesome. They're, <coughs> excuse me, they're cool. So I got a bunch of superhero comics and stuff because I'm a, I'm a superhero fan. I got a My Little, or my, I keep always saying My Little Pony. Yeah, I it's... got a Hello Kitty comic. Gosh, You got darn. a bunch of other ones too. You got some Teen Titans and... I got a uh, Archie. The Origin 2 Wolverine comic. That's mm -hmm. pretty sweet in a weird way. In a weird way? <laughs> oh yeah, the comic itself was not it's, sweet. It's dark as all <laughs> left, but it was, a, it's a, it was pretty sweet that you got that one. Then we got a Sonic the Hedgehog Mega Man X comic. Mm -hmm. That's like my favorite one. That's cool as heck. I know. I'm so Like, you got so excited when we got that. Well, because I saw it there and I was like, oh my god, these are the coolest comics yet. And because we got all the signatures from uh, the artists there, we get these. And I was like, oh god, uh, how do I pick one of them? And they're like, it's double-sided. You get both. And I was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. It was the best thing ever. <laughs> mm. It was so much fun to see my friends. Me. 
<laughs> and Jordan. Vegeta's level 36. Is he high enough yet? <laughs> Probably. No, we also got to hang out with Kirsten. That was cool. Oh, yeah. I love Kirsten. She's such a beautiful girl. She's mm. cool. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> Quit trying to hook me up with Kirsten. Why not? She's a she's a beauty. I was joking. <laughs> so, I don't know. I mean, what were you gonna let say? Let me see. I think that was enough grinding. Now, like, aren't we as strong as everybody else now? Check our stats. I think you're right. I think, yeah, I think we are. They're level thirty-one or something, right? Mm -hmm. And I think <laughs> Vegeta just turned level thirty-six. Yeah. So check he, that. Uh, went up significantly from these guys. How do we check the uh, other ones? Press button. Press buttons. That wasn't the button. Oh, there we go. All right, so Trunks 31, Piccolo 32. Uh, I'm the ones on the last thing. Well. Yeah, Vegeta's strongest. So we know what we're going to be doing next time. We're going to be grinding <laughs> Gohan. Hmm? Yeah. Oh. We're going to be grinding four-year-old Gohan. Oh. Oh. You, you, your voice sounds <laughs> excited, but your face doesn't look it. All right, let's continue. The next time we grind, we'll be off screen. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> I didn't say anything. Robots. Destroy them all. Robot. Ro robot. Your butt. Your butt. What about it? It's a butt. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> you end up telling everybody in the videos about my butt pretty much every video anyway. Really? Have I? Oh, did you just see how the game he glitched went, and the alligator was, butt through, was through the cliff? No, now we're That's talking about funny. his butt. <laughs> I prefer when you talk about mine. Oh, fine. But, but, but. I know it is. But, Jordan's but. <laughs> what about it? It's a but. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so how are you doing, Sharp? Besides the fact we were out all day, we got some got some lunch. Oh, uh, hung out with your friend Kirsten. Hey, kitties! <gasps> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Goodbye, kitties. <laughs> oh, well. Now that we know what to expect. So, I mean. Uh, how was your day? <laughs> <laughs> my day was pretty good. I had a good day so far. Good. I'm gonna go out with my mom tomorrow, so that's gonna be nice. Yeah, it is. <sighs> Hopefully it is, because... But I'm gonna miss you. I don't know, my mom's been keeping a happy face up lately, so... Yeah, it's not like her at all. <laughs> you should come and visit me more. Why are there so many alligators? Uh, cause crikey. 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 God, that's one of my favorite gifts of the internet. Crikey. That was funny. I'm I glad love you Steve. Me that. I love Steve Irwin. Steve He's... Irwin is cool. It still is cool. Attack them from far away. I'm trying to get close, but they're not... Yeah. If only I wasn't one mile per hour. <laughs> oh! <laughs> to battle! Okay, he's dead. Chicken. Chicken. Ow! Oh, he's hiding, the little you bastard. You dick! Ha <laughs> chicken. Oh, but you're running out robot? of power. Yeah, I'm gonna turn back into normal Saiyan Vegeta. <gasps> ah! I guess not! <laughs> <laughs> no, we'll do it. Um. So does this work like that? Are you? Are you supposed I didn't to punch know he was, He's like, oh my god, me. that was so creepy. Oh, I'm your, I'm not oh your father. Oh my god, I don't want to punch pterodactyls though. <laughs> you did like you did in Bruce Fury. What? We had an entire part called pterodactyl. I know we did, but that's not why I said pterodactyl. It's just because there's a P there. I just pick. I just feel like there. You should say the P. So I bet we could have just done the grinding here instead of with those initial alligators. That's fine. I didn't realize that there would be so much more. Quit hitting me! I know, right? These cats are really getting oil. into you. <laughs> yeah, chicken. Chicken. Oh, tree. Mama had a cow. Dad had a chicken. I was proud. You didn't care how. Punch, 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 punch. Pow, pow. Punch, punch, punch. The problem punch, is, punch. because Vegeta's so slow and the cats are so fast, uh -huh. they can get a lot more hits in in the time it takes for him to yeah. be like, Ugh. I know everyone's back here. Ow. Yeah, eat the golden castle. Da-da-da-da. Da-da-da-da. Ba-da-da-da. Da-da-da-da. Okay, so sorry. <laughs> you better be. I think you peeked the F out of the mic just then. I'm sorry. Vegeta is level 37. What level, well, what level did he have to be? 30. 30. Yeah, we're Yay. good. <laughs> Thank goodness we went ahead. Bridge, and bridge, 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 water. bridge. What's that? Aha! He thought he was safe back there. Oh, He's going to yeah. sneak out and attack me. <laughs> Wait, there could have been hidden food back there. I guess not. I wonder where this bridge goes. Oh, it's the Namek. <laughs> where Hi. is it? This guy? <laughs> 
I lived a life of luxury in West City. There was nothing I couldn't have, but it was an empty life. I decided to just come here to the island and live a simple life, casting away all of my possessions. I hope you sold them first. Here, take the car to my apartment. You can have anything you want there. That's a note. Hey, you can have another apartment. I'm beyond the material world now, man. Oh. It's aliens, man. Hi. A place where the dynamic steak house can go. <laughs> 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 oh my god, so much do really... I wish I could be like pink and the giant rake would smack me in the face. Aww. It really is a giant rake. I really rake. like the length of this Look at the length of the rake. That is a really long like, rake. <laughs> oh, oh, I can't punch. I was going to beat the crap out of those butterflies. I mean, walk with them. <laughs> Yellow butterflies are my favorite. I thought you liked monarchs. Huh? Blue oh, I do like monarchs too. I'm just saying that whenever I see a yellow butterfly, it fills my heart with joy. What about when you see me? Shouldn't we check out the rest of the island? Because I feel like we didn't actually explore all of it. What happens when you see me? My heart also fills with joy. Is that it? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and pants need to be changed. Mm, you should just commission somebody to make you a pant, or make you, a, make you pants, to make you a song about pants. About pants? You seem to have problems with pants. Do I? Wink. Ah. <laughs> Other than the fact I can't keep them on, what problem do I have with pants? <laughs> That's true, they always fall off. They fall off, or they break, or rip, or tear. Or... Like, seriously, the pants you showed me the other day were, like, terrible. My jammies? <laughs> oh, I felt so sorry for your pants. I feel sorry for anybody that stands behind feel me. Feel sorry for this cat. Hole. There we go. We're exploring. More pterodactyls. Pterodactyl. The pterodon. All right, so just go left. Pediatricists. <laughs> I tried to fuse. I, I noticed. Pediatric. No, go left. I was gonna beat these guys up. Oh, okay. <clears throat> See what was up here, just in case there's like a thingy, a capsule. That's what they're called. Excuse me. No, no, go back. But they're the same area. Go back. Okay. <laughs> okay. See, I just wanted to make sure that that was it. What? I just wanted I know, to. I feel okay. They're all drooping. They're all drooping. Oh, now they're getting like slower. Why don't I have special bean cannon right go. now? I'm glad Big Bang Attack was finally able to kill something. I know, right? Like, Big Bang Attack that you've been using lately have not been very good. Big Bang Theory! I about. haven't watched that show. Yeah, it just hasn't I, intrigued me. I never me. watched it. I know the theme song kind of ish. I've heard that before. I know the <laughs> cute song that of the soft kitty, warm kitty. What? There's a song in it that, like, I think Sheldon has his Isn't girlfriend sing to him. Isn't the show just like a sitcom, but about like nerds, a really nerdy dude? Yeah. Who like more? At our, least that's what I understand. They like surpass us in nerdum. Oh yeah, way more. But at least that's all I've gotten from the show. And now we've been everywhere. Have we? Because north of here is where we first okay. met the kitties. Alright, well then let's go back. Whee! What's 